There's no losing, only learning. There's no failure, only opportunities. And there's no problems, only solutions. So to me, what failure is, failure is the mother of all success. If it wasn't for Michael Jordan getting cut from his ninth grade basketball team, he wouldn't have became Michael Jordan. You know, if it wasn't for, uh, I seen an, an article the other day where they were talking about Oprah Winfrey and how she got fired because she wasn't good for television. You know, you got people like Walt Disney who got fired, if I'm not mistaken, from a newspaper saying he had no imagination. These are the same people that I got to deal with. Tell me what's not, what's not a hit record. Right, right, right. <laughs> you know, that, that all they can do is learn and come back bigger, better, stronger, because all it's going to do is lead you in the right direction. See, if you're always winning, then you don't really understand what it is to win. You got to take those losses. You got to take those hits. There's got to be the valleys, the peaks, the ups, the downs. In order for you to, when it does happen, you go, wow, this is what it's all about. And your brain is the most powerful weapon. I talk about that in one of these chapters. Your brain is the most powerful weapon in the world. Once you put away your phones and your computers and all that shit we have nowadays, that's yeah, great. We're up to date. You, you know, you, but your brain is the only thing you have when you're going through depression, when, you, when you're going through hard times, you're going through death, real life shit. You can't Google that shit, man. You're alone. You're alone. You may have a shrink you're going to, you may have a best friend you're going to, but there's 24 hours in the day when you're alone in this brain. And your brain is talking to you in all kinds of ways. And it wants to control you and pull you in these different pockets. If you can't control your own brain and your brain controls you, you're fucked. You gotta tell your brain where you wanna go and how you wanna go and how you wanna get there. You gotta control it. If not, it's over. People will quit on you. And sometimes it's the ones you did the most for. But you can't let those that quit on you make you wanna quit on yourself. You can't let those that have given up on you make you wanna give up on yourself. Listen, I know it hurts when the ones you count on have counted you out. I know it hurts when the ones you believe in stop believing in you. I know it hurts when the ones you helped up are now kicking you while you're down. But you have to understand this about life. Just because you did right by them doesn't mean they're gonna return the favor and do right by you. One thing you gotta realize in this world, everybody ain't gonna have a heart like you. Some people will let you down straight up. True colors always get revealed when it gets real. So don't let the ones that changed on you change you. You work hard, you make money, you do it for yourself. That's not life. You go out, you seek for people who need your help, you make their lives better. You become that sponge which can absorb all the negativity and you become that person who can emit beautiful positive vibes and when you realize that you have changed someone's life and because of you this person didn't give up that is the day when you live always <laughs>